I've been wanting to make this video <laughs> since I was in school. Now, y'all gonna have to forgive me because I cannot find the rest of my selfie stick. So now I gotta hold the phone and hopefully it's not all shaking and stuff, whatever. So I went to Empire Beauty School. Um, I will say that I learned some things. I definitely did. It's a lot of things I didn't know how to do. But um, I feel like, I'm getting straight to the point. I feel like Empire as a whole could improve. I feel as though for the amount of money that students are paying, there's no reason why any student should walk out of that door and not be 100% in the skills that they came to learn. I don't want to hear, oh, the students give us, give, you know, give us attitude and this, 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 whatever the case may be. It may be frustration because the student doesn't know what they're doing. Whatever. I just felt like there was a lot of excuses made when I went there. I, you know, and I said I was, <laughs> okay. Um, so let's rewind to the beginning. You start, you get a tour of the building. Oh my God, you're excited. You see all the students on the floor. They're taking their guests, whatever. The lady gives you the tour, hypes you up. You sign your paperwork. You come in for orientation. Orientation is great. You get to see all the students that you'll be in class with. You meet all the instructors, the um, director, everything. So do your orientation at this point, you're hyped. You're like, yes, oh my God, I finally, you know, signed up, getting something checked off my list, whatever the case may be. Um, first day you come in again in the classroom, <laughs> in the classroom with students, you get your suitcase. Yo, the suitcase is packed. I'm not even going to hold you. You get flat irons, you get your combs, you get your nail kit, you get the blow dryer, you get capes, you get clips, you get everything you could possibly need for your journey at Empire. Um, so, you know, I can't remember and I should, but listen, when I say I wanted to get out of there, I could not wait. Um, you get, I think, four months of classroom time and then maybe five months on the floor. And that's assuming that you come every day on time. You don't miss no days because the program is originally nine months. So I think that's how you split it up. Don't don't um quote me. So you do the classroom time. Now we're in the classroom. We're breezing by this stuff. We breezing by this stuff. We go over the chapter one day, and I swear to goodness, you got a test the next day. They give you the book. They're like, basically learn it on your own. I understand we're adults. You gotta. I don't know. <laughs> I'm so irritated. Like I can't even get my freaking thoughts out right. I should have wrote it down. But I felt like the information that we got in the books, they breezed by it really fast. We didn't really go over it too much. It was just kind of like, oh, you know, figure it out on your own. We're giving you the material. Read it over yourself at home. Blah, blah, blah. I don't like that. So let's fast forward. We're on the floor. And uh, now at this point, you're taking guests. You're a real hairstylist. You're doing hair. You're doing nails. Everything. <laughs> We're doing nails. So, um, I went on the floor, I think in like March of 2017. So spring is coming around the corner. Everyone's coming. They want to get their nails done, their toes done. Now here's the thing. I was told two different things. I was told we don't use cuticle nippers because I think they said something about clients that have like diabetes. You don't want to cut them and things like that. Then I was told, oh, you can use the nippers. So I say, hey, guys, how am I going to use the nippers when we weren't taught how to use them? So she says, well, if you feel comfortable using them, just use them anyway. Okay. I don't like that. I think that's kind of weird. Now, I will say, I'm going to pause <laughs> my empire bashing. Um, this is not for any of my instructors. Like, my instructors were great. My director was even better. I mean, she really, 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 really goes hard for those students. I will tell you that she she's slick with her tongue, but that woman goes so hard. And I love her for that because she went hard for me. This is not for the instructors. I just think Empire as a whole needs a little revamping. So anyway, back into my story. So the location that I was at, we had a lot of African-American clients. So I felt like 
we didn't get a good, um, I don't want to say lesson. I feel like a lot of people, if they didn't know anything about hair, was, wouldn't be prepared for what to do. Like we had a lot of women that came in there and I mean, their hair is tightly coiled. So I think they need to show us, you know, how to properly detangle that hair. What products could we use to, you know, soften the hair, like things like that. Like I feel like a lot of the products that we had at the school were mainly for, you know, women with fine, already straight hair. You know what I'm saying without actually having to say it. So I'm like, we don't have any products here that would, you know, benefit our African-American women or, you know, the ones that had a tighter texture here. Um, and then we weren't allowed to bring any of our own stuff. So that didn't help. Um, hmm. <laughs> I just honestly, I couldn't wait to get out. I'm not, I, I couldn't wait to get out. I could not wait to get out of that freaking school. Like, <sighs> wow. I, I just, I, I could, I'm not going to say I don't recommend it, but I would say save your money. I know it's not a huge, like we don't have like a huge, um, a lot, whole bunch of schools that you can go to for beauty. I know it's, it's some, but it's not like a whole lot. So I'm, I, save your money. Save your time. I mean, mm -mm. no, I just feel like for the amount of money that we pay, I shouldn't have to hear out of an educator's mouth. Oh, we're only here to teach you the basics. Really? For 22,000, I'm only here for the basics. I could have went on YouTube to learn the basics. I need to learn how to, you know, ugh. my head hurt just thinking about it. I'm so glad. So glad that hey got up out of there. Honestly, if I had a daughter or if my little sister said, hey, I'm going to go to beauty school, <laughs> Empire would not be first on the list. I'll tell you that much. Um, but we did have moments. We had good times, you know. You bond with your clients. I love them and I miss them so, 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 so much. I have one educator that I absolutely, she's just so positive. Love her to death. Like if we had more of her at the Empires around the world, we probably could, it probably would be a little better. Probably be a little better. But listen, this video is already seven minutes long. I feel like I didn't cover all of what I wanted to. Maybe I'll make a part two. Maybe I'll make a part two. I think I will. Because at this point, my mind is going blank. And I was going to type it all in my phone. Like, okay, let me just read it, read it, read it. But ciao. I'm good. I'm good on the Empire. I'm good. I'm good. I'm glad to be done. Um, <laughs> that's all I can say. I don't, I don't really have nothing else to say, but don't waste your money, baby. Do not waste your money.